Welcome to a new update and today we're going to briefly touch on the altcoin portfolio on which we can't do much at this point as I said in the beginning that it's a swing trade altcoin portfolio but we're going to develop a few strategies and in this short update I'll be providing you some information behind the actual thesis at this point so what are we going to look at I think we're going to look at a hold strategy but that's what we're going to dive in into this short update before we continue make sure to hit the like button subscribe to the youtube channel also check out my other social media platform where you can find more information on the markets and also make sure to check out our platform where you can copy trade my portfolio and more when we're looking at the altcoin portfolio i started with a thousand bucks which we have done a few weeks ago you can find the other video on my youtube channel and we have been buying a few altcoins and you can find them here so we have invested around 250 bucks into Chainlink. We've invested in Curve, RSR. We've invested in Atom. We have invested in Axie Infinity and Lux. And as you can see, we are down 16% at this point, which means that we are underwater and we have to have a new strategy at this point. I think that if we look at the markets, we can conclude that probably we're going to go down a little bit more um, as markets have to establish a potential, potential bottoming structure. I'm not too happy with the results at this point as I was expecting the markets to continue rallying but at this point we just have to hold on to what we have got in the markets here. Does it make sense to swap the, the positions at this point that doesn't make that much sense. The, the one that is down the most is definitely looks at this point as the rest in, including Chainlink are barely down anything since we have been buying it. Um, so let's have a look. The markets I've discussed yesterday, um, they are most likely going to have some sort of correction, but we build our thesis based from the daily time frame in which we can conclude that most of the altcoins are currently on the edge of holding support, right? So Chainlink here is just consolidating within a range. I start to establish a potential strategy the moment that it starts to trend up. So then I'm going to move my stop loss up, but for now it's just a portfolio that I'll be holding for several months. And that means that I'll be underwater for a little bit and have some pain there, but I can't adapt towards a different strategy at this point unless I want to include more risk, which means that I swap my chain link towards looks to make sure that I'm going to grant myself additional opportunities at this point. But as you can see, chain link is around the area that we use to actually buy the, uh, the positions at this point. So we're just going to stabilize. There's not much we can do at this point. Um, there are a few altcoins that are having some pain and one of them is looks, which is currently having a very downwards trending markets stabilizing around the range low and then you can question yourself does it make sense for me to actually swap the position or sell the position uh, what you should be doing is that you're looking at the chart to say okay if I see this chart right now what would I do if I didn't have any position at all so that's what we're going to do here I'll go through through the charts for a little bit and then we can conclude First of all, if we look at looks, it's currently bottoming out, which means that we might be getting a low towards 12 cents again, but we are in the process of bottoming out and I'm only getting interested into adjusting my strategy once it breaks through 19 cents. So if we consolidate here, or actually 16 can be done too. If we consolidate here, I think I do not change much on the strategy itself, which means that I'll just consolidate by having my position still and I'll be looking to break through here to actually start adapting with the stop loss and take profits to actually compound my gains, which is the core focus of this portfolio. When we're looking at curve, we can conclude the exact same. We are just stabilizing here. Uh, the prices are just barely down. We can still have a sweep of the lows here, but ultimately we are still into support. And in the meantime, it starts to rain quite heavily here. Now also we've got RSR, which is currently showing a case where we are having a bottoming procedure. So everything in the portfolio is currently into the bottoming procedure. If you get towards a part of what we are going to achieve with the portfolio in the next update, and that's going to be after my holiday, I'll be providing you a full strategy of how I'm going to place the trades on this portfolio, how I'm going to manage those. And as I said, I will be providing all the information continuously. So I will not be skipping. I'll just provide the information, give you a full strategy, and then we can continue building as my target is to give you a portfolio which makes the most sense to actually follow at this point. All the positions are underwater, which is okay. 
probably they will be on the water for a little bit more that's part of trading i'll just be holding on to as i'm currently seeing a chart and question yourself a chart in which are you going to sell or buy here and i think that holding on to the positions is the conclusion for now i'm down 17 percent i'll be back up with a new update later on which is going to be a relatively long and fresh update ciao